just um, get my camera on. Sorry, that's been a while. Well, actually, no, actually, my face. Oops, my bad. I probably should have said that, but I did. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to just go to bed. Oh, man. I think right, man. Just so I can edit it into it. What you're going to see, that, okay, I'll start with that. What you're going to see in my pro, in this project, right, is not what you expect. It's not going to be the best. We haven't put everything into it yet. So when recording it, it, there was a few like recording problems, which eventually we'll fix that, and I'll tell you later about it, right? You're going to watch it, there's going to be a bunch of parts that are cut between stuff, like, because things that happen in between were just kind of broken a bit, and were ruined, and stuff like that, it just, all, it just collapsed, right? Um, so we put in as much as possible, we put in um, everything as possible, but we're not, but we didn't bother putting in everything, right, we didn't put, okay. We didn't bother putting in everything because, um, <laughs> we didn't put everything in, um, because as we said, we're not putting every, we're not putting a lot into it, we're just putting in a tiny bit, I think it was like a teaspoon, right? it's, it's a small spoon of just stuff, right? if you want us, like, if you want to watch more, if you want us to extend it, we can. And that's what the plan was anyway. That was for you guys to look at it and go, I like it, I want to see more of it. Um, and then we'll remake the project. Right? We'll remake it. It's going to be much longer because this is only 16 minutes. That's the set of things. Come on. Hectic, right? um, and so we're going to redo it. We're going to add in more stuff. We're going to add more of everything. But not everything. See, now, now I'm playing with your mind. Uh, I'm going to put in... We're going to make it longer, basically. We're going to make the whole video longer. So we redo it. We're going to make it longer. It's going to be on Rumble. Um, YouTube. It's going to be on two channels on YouTube. It's going to be on one channel on Rumble. I will link the channel that's going on. Because the channel is just made for series and whatever. Right? So we're going to put it on there. Um, and yeah. And then we're going to continue. Um, I just hope you guys like it. Because it is. It's big for me. I mean. Uh, I, I have leaked a few things. To just people I know. And they have questioned it. I have a bunch of people who. You guys may not know um, who are going to be in it, so that is going to be a good thing for you. Um, as you may know, right, um, CVIA is no longer, but the members, right? How many members do I say were in? Five, right? Technically, there was six. Now, I didn't explain this properly, right? So, I'm allowed to say Marl, because it's Marl, he allowed it. He's going to be in this series. Uh, he's uh, bad, bad, bad. Spoiled it. He's going to be in the project. We're going to have Damon in the project. We're going to have Julian and 
Eli, all of us are going to be in the series. We're going to have some long-time friends that have been previously on this channel. Some of them, anyway. Like, one of them who's been on this channel um, is going to be in it for... I can't tell you how long they're going to be in it for, but we're going to get little cameos of people that we, we've known on this channel majority of them we don't have any contact because majority of the time it's on a game that it's contact. see if i go to my videos right now jewels oh um penguin animations i might have to write him um, Kane, maybe not, I'm sorry Kane, but may, 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 maybe not, <laughs> uh, it's going to be a while if you were, my mother, who uh, was on the channel six months ago, god, that's a long time, possibility, it's a possibility, I'm not, as I said, I'm not going to spell anything, um, Pablo, one member from Pablo that's going to be in it, yes, <laughs> I had to make sure, Rocket League, we, on Rocket League we played with Reese, which was the sixth member of CVIA, you would have seen it, because we did CV3, CV2 or something, and he's really good at Rocket League, but he's Rocket League side of us. Chad Michael Collins, who was on the channel twice, and I'm upset that me playing with Alex didn't actually get views, so surely everyone knows Chad Michael Collins, who played as Alex in Modern Warfare 2019, and in Raid Episode 3, and in Warzone, and in Warzone 2. I played with him, I spoke to him. Uh, and we played a game. We played two, three games of Warzone together on the other side. I might ask him to do a little voice for me, but he's over in America, so it's a bit impossible. But I, if I can, I'll try. <laughs> if I can, I'll try and get him in. There's a few people that have been on the channel that I'm now mortal enemies with. Not mortal, but there's people on the channel that I'm just pure enemies with who aren't going to be in it, but people who I'm still friends with. Pretty much guaranteed. Yeah, long with the story. Yeah, pretty much guaranteed that um, it's happening. So, there you go. Um, Hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you at the end of that video. Who's that? Yeah, I'll see you at the end of the project video. Um, and I, I really do hope you guys enjoy it. And if you're still watching this intro, then good on you because. <laughs> Because if you skip this intro, you have no preparation for the future. So yeah, I'll see you at the end of it. If you guys have enjoyed, that's kind of expected because as I said, we're not putting anything into it. But um, you know, if we can do more with it, that's what we're expecting. We're expecting people to comment on it and go, yeah, um, it would have been better if you added more of this or um. You know, just so we want that stuff, and honestly, I don't care if you tear it down because that's what we're looking for. We're looking for people 
who enjoy it. We're looking for people who support it and try and help us make it more better. We're trying to get all these people, you know? We're trying to get all these people. So, yeah, hope you guys like it. Okay. Hello, John. I'm just stuck here. Let's go. Okay. Boom. Oh no, that's not good. I don't think that's supposed to do that. I don't think that's supposed to do that. Oh, yeah, no, they've just run away. They've just run away. Yeah, no, stop. Stop. You're not supposed to be doing that. You're not supposed to be. Uh, no, it would have been done. His run is so... Milton, get over here. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, nah, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, <laughs> Milton. John, Jim, Thank Milton. you. For the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey. Hey! Get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here. Something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. It's imagine having that name, bro. Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. I can do that. Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Ah, uh, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? That, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we, uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no, You're sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton, how fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kinda... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You hey. are going to milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I, don't know I, I, I thought you was... Uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It's about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Where are you from, anyway, partner? 
Around, you know, up north, mostly. Been these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Oh. Just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Here's the cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. But most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, just sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Got a pail full. <clears throat> hey, Pa. Is that your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your pa yet. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all got to earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. How old are you now, Lancelot? Twelve, sir. Ain't that great. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got... I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now, it ain't pleasant work, but it's got to be done. Mr. Dickens said... I know what he said. We'll do it. Won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. Jack, let's just... Try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Can you clean that? Why do you call him Seth? That's what You're I was. A long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. You almost got me. Ah. Moving up. I think your mother's hiding somewhere, laughing at us. That stinks. <laughs> it's cow. <coughs> Fuck that. And even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. Not the hat. Out of everything you couldn't have had a good hat. Let's see, it's a bit like that. Why? I'm so confused as to why he runs like this.
Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? <clears throat> Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I just hate I'm tired of fleeing, John. Like shorter so, than when well, I you know. the first thing. Me too. Put some coffee on. <laughs> no pillow, just not even a blanket either. See how that suits him. Jala. Yeah, I'll be right. Okay, this is closer, so I'm gonna go to it. This one from the tree. Well, right, Abe was said, nice. Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more. Yo, Landon. About to pull, sir, and no hands uh. to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Still spells the name of Pa! Hey. Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. A good man. Can you help my boy, my hey, youngest granny. daughter? granny. He will yeah, insist on good. riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for That's him. Good. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. He's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Because since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. <laughs> hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. Yeah. So, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh. Uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just a thing in there. The I better get two. Thanks, kid. Kid, you come you Duncan? I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. You need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. You done? Come on. Easy. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh. Someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? <sighs> Calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. I'll be in the corral, Ben. Okay. <laughs> Everything you got. Come on.
got some energy? Show me then. Oh, this kid's got this kid's got this kid's got Me there. So. All right, he's ready for you. Okay, get on up there and <laughs> go nice and slow. Stay calm. Me, the horse, you're calm. The heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... but... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. See? You know, this time to speed up. You, Mr. Milton? I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. So, you know much about Milton? Not too much. My God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, ma'am. You want me to put my hand in the horse's... <laughs> Okay, now hold on and pull. Grip them. Oh, I slipped. It's coming out one way or another. Grab them again. Come on. Okay, well, I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we, we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm busy. Uh, too busy for social calls. Of course. 
Good day, Mr. Milton. Please. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For <clears throat> him. How's he been? He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. <laughs> Damn, he's so smart as an old. I'm still confused as to why he closed his mouth. So. Round to the left. What do you see? Pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding, aside from home? I don't know, but maybe that stream? Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on, you know. The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident, okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. There you go, Jack. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a... See? You can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa! Hey. Now let's slow it down. Whoa, boy! I want you again to knock off the horse now, do we? Maybe I should do that. Pushing me no, off the. This ain't so bad, sir. Dad, dad, dad. Don't call me, sir. Dad. Hey. Give me that. I mean, you call me sir. I, I hate it. Don't call your own father, sir. That's just weird. Yes, yeah, sir. Better than before. Keep at it. Slow now, man. Why don't fast. we speed it up again? Okay. Speed it up again. Come on.
Here we are. Yep. We should get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ridge. Okay. On my go. Go! Oh, you sneak. Oh boy, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Come on. Oh boy. Your oh horse is much bigger. And you're much smaller. <coughs> like a jockey. jockey. Huh? Oh, the overtake. Come on, boy. Come Master, on. Come on. I want to be nice, Jack. I think it's just better that way. Son. <laughs> I beat I like you. It. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. Should <coughs> have. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Give the place a tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. Are you sleeping there? You've been holding it for Hey, Milton, can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Well, there's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Okay, bet easy. Now lift up the other side. You gotta line up. See? Now the next rail. This place is so sweet. You're doing all right. Fine.
good. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. Oh no, I didn't do that one. I hope you've grabbed <coughs> the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Count sections. They just follow the line. Let me see the guy. Jim Melton, <coughs> over here. Give it a second. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. I like a little. Hurry. Hurry. I'm trying, man. But... Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. <coughs> Let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Uh, come on! Move! Uh, oh, oh, oh. Oh, shit! I'll get him! Just keep on him, Milton. I gotta build that! Bad boy! Hey. Hey, boy. Shoot. Over here. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. You're an angry one. Whoa there. Whoa there. Easy. Easy. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. There, there. <coughs> there, there. You got a temper on you. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of Chuck. Stubborn, ain't you? <laughs> Let's go. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. Fancy parents get he's paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, get him. Get him. Oh, get him. oh, kick his head in, boss! <laughs> ah. <Ooh>. no. <laughs> yeah!
out of there. Get off him! He hit me first. Well, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in the brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> well, what'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will you? Hi, I'm from India. Plenty, you moron. Nice to meet you. Plenty. What'd you get up to? We all get caught eventually, John. I Where are you from? Australia. I am from Australia. Now, dear, I, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Nice. Not in yeah. Men. You what have you been up to? All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Uh, I know you will. <laughs> so how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> Yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, <coughs> I guess. Better? You know India vs Australia test match cricket going on England. I know. I'm sorry to say this, but I don't watch cricket. Anybody want some more? Hmm. But I want to no, know who wins. Thank you. I miss Mr. Hey, and it's currently on because I might actually look You're at such it. a pig. <laughs> 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 All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Oh, we're winning. We're winning. We're winning, blood. What the hell was that? What are you, what are you doing? Where Good job. Have a deal. He's Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. So that's a lot. Holy Jim! They got Dickens! Over by the stables! It's over. Who's this? I love this game, but I not have PC. Oh yeah. You don't need PC. I don't know if you see that. Just took off. Yeah, I heard about you. Crap. Dub Hicks brought this on yourselves. I'll be up in a moment. He ain't getting up. They've killed Mr. Tobert and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. Who's Mr. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks it can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, uh, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. <coughs> I know you can... You coming daylight, you live on YouTube. Guns and guns. Oh, don't play cool um, with me, son. I don't we do need your help. Every single day, there are a lot going on. I have said it. Your name is... This is the land of second chances. That understood. Apparently, okay. there's a lot of stuff throughout the week. Come in, it's me. But if you're lucky, I can. What was it? <coughs> Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, no, if I, if I can. Okay. No, Mr. Getty's been real good to us. <coughs> we, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. 
sure it is his job. I'll lead the way. Oh. This is gonna be the last we hear. He's wearing. Yeah, yeah. He's wearing yeah. off his hat. Right. He's wearing off his hat. That's. That's nice. I miss Arthur, but I still I like John. Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. <clears throat> you playing GTA V? There's our cows. Um, a couple guards out I front. I do play GTA V. Couple more around the side, I imagine. This is not GTA V. Let's get a closer look. This Let's go. If that's what you mean, if that's what you meant. But just yeah, like, there's plenty of guards. I'm, I'm gonna head straight in. Yep. Tom, you head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. <clears throat> hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn! Bye, bro. Bye. Where am I supposed to go? I got thrown into that. I had no idea what to do. <laughs> see you soon, bro. Yep, see you soon as well. Coming up to Pronghorn. I thought I'd come down here. You're up. So tough. Come have a word with me. You here to cut a deal?
shot my feet up. I'm <clears throat> with this. You boys take cattle. Hey. Hey. I know you're in here. Piss digging, <sighs> shoveling, backwoods, sacker, no good, trash. You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes for Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about, Abe, just in case you stay up? Yep. See anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. We'll do. Uh, well <laughs> said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? You be safe. Yeah, you have to us to do it. What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. <clears throat> These visions are going somewhere. Getting on. Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. The only thing I know how to do is. Well, you know. Undertakers like me. Cattle? <clears throat> not so much. That ain't true. 
Ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was, I was reading the newspaper. The beads I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. <coughs> Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and is he I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. You're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am. <clears throat> Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> Okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. <coughs> Come on. Get. You take care now. Of course. It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in the house, Pa. I think just about doing things you like, boy. Oh, boy. What happened the other night with those men? Did you kill them? I did what I had to do to protect you. Why are we stopping? We got stuck Ma in it. Said go back. It was pride or something. The law was wrong about that. This is real fast. Yes, yeah, son. Go. Here. Want to take the reins a little? No. No. I, I don't know, Pa. No. I, it's easy, boy. Don't be scared. Well, uh, w what do I do? Well, just do just what I want. Just closely just hit them. Pull them short to slow down. Tell them to go faster. Give them a little switch. And then pull to one side if you want to turn. Here. Try it <coughs> out. No. No. Because they're going to be slow. to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. Now we're stuck here. <clears throat> what are we gonna do? I'll leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, sure. I think I can be trusted at that. Very good. You wanna start something? I was just coming by. Why do I remember this place? Why does this place look so familiar? All right, here we are. <coughs> you all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. Hello. Hi. I'm here What's to. Your name? My name? Uh, Jim Milton. 
Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. <coughs> yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. <clears throat> I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, had let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Have to uh, out uh, my name? Mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pa? Sure. I hope so, at least. Here. You take the reins a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Hey. Yeah! We're going back to Pronghorn. Okay? Team. So, wait. We've come all the way out here, and we're just going to turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out... Uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I think. You've got to be go kidding me. The saloon or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. Exactly. And watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Don't. Jesus. Find your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Stop calling me sir, it's me. No, don't do this. If I tell you to speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down, okay? That's it. Uh, That's it. Sure. That's it. All right, yeah. speed up. I need you, you to speed up. I need okay. you to speed up. Speed up, please. We've got people watching us. Slow, down, on Slow it down. Don't want to seem like we're running away from anything. Uh, okay. Whoa. Who's this? Sorry, sir. Was that a question for me? No. No. Keep driving. Speed up. Actually, you, you know what? Faster. Yes, sir. Yeah. Speed up, mate. What's wrong, Pa? Nothing. When I tell you keep your head down, then you keep your head down. Okay. Yeah. You put, if I tell you to put your head down, you need to put it down. Let's speed this up. Is somebody back there? Just keep driving. It's the same as any other road. Look where you want to go and the horse will follow. Okay. Guys. I think the horse is getting skittish. He'll be alright. He is. Yeah. Huh? What the f- what? Nothing. Just keep driving. Okay. Now, what? Yeah. What's wrong? Don't yeah. look around. Yeah. Oh, Pop, hey. those men, are they following us? Just, just stay calm. Jack. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly do it. as I say, boy. Here, now. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, <coughs> come on. Quick, now. Bloody 
you sly as kid. Okay, sir. Oh, right. You wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Good boy. Okay, gentlemen. <coughs> Let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are friendly you John Morrison? You sure look like him. We're here for a John Morrison. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? No. Wasn't me. That was my brother. I'm sorry, but I have no idea who the hell you're talking about. I'm real sorry, friend, but he was trying to rob Use my gun anyway. What? Why? What? It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Keep them eyes closed. Let's go. I killed his brother. <laughs> he was trying to rob me, and I have no idea who he's talking about. I still to this day. I have no idea who the hell he's talking about. Whose brother, whose brother did I kill that was trying to rob me? I had to. Jack, I had to or you were real brave back there. Real brave. Did exactly like I said. Really? Uh-huh. Yes, you did, Jack, okay? If you had to listen, things could have gone real wrong for us. Jack, breathe. Breathe, buddy. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I can slow down, I can slow down, I can slow down. Okay. Yeah, I can slow down for you. Uh, you know, your mama wants us to buy some old ranch. You read to her about it, didn't you? Mm-hmm. What was it called? Mm-hmm. What was what it called? What was the name? Was Beecher's it? Hope. That's Beecher's right. Hope, okay. Beecher's Hope. Over by Blackwater. Yeah. You like the idea of that, huh? Us on the ranch? I don't know. I can see you as ranch. Just breathe. Like Doug and Gettys, huh? I wasn't so sure, but yeah, that kind of life might suit us. Wouldn't be such a chore if the horses we were cleaning up <laughs> after was ours, would it? <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Mm. Hey, Jack, just you'll be okay. Be this way. No, he's had a free throw. Calm down a bit, right? Uh, no, it is high. Okay, so. here we are. That was an he did really. uh, eventful trip. Yeah. So glad that your mother wanted me to take you. What was Let's that? Say hi to your mother. I said, take me. Oh, God, she's not going to be happy. How was the. <clears throat> what Jeez. happened? Yeah. It's. I don't. We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed, and then... We... Followed by who? Uh, probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son. Yeah, well, it was your fault for putting the parcel in your own... It was your dress that caused all the problem. It weren't even a dress. It was a gift for you. <laughs> If you just had have put it in our fake identity name, this wouldn't have happened. Okay, so don't blame this on me. Hey, Mr. Jim. You put it in your name. Mr. Jim. Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there near the house. 
There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. What do you think you want? She's going off of me. No She's idea. going off of me. Yeah, right. But I doubt it's her phone, mate. Big pile of money. <laughs> she put in her name. If I, I hadn't, if I hadn't have done it, Thanks, it wouldn't have happened. If you just put in enough like that entities, we wouldn't have had to deal with anything, and Jack would have been all right with our bloody shock out of himself. Excuse me, Mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me. Oh, yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got oh. something to discuss. Sadie Adler. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Stop what? Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Actually, Charles disappeared, didn't he? Because Charles, Charles wasn't trying to shoot me. He like opened someone. Abigail. Don't do this, darling John. A kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had many problems of her own, but that's a different story. <coughs> Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. What? Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. What? We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... This part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. This is my job. And I love this you is too much job. to and watch that you're doing no this. more. Abigail. It was my job. I had to do it. My boss t told me to, mate. And then you put your own bloody parcel and both of our real name. Why? <laughs> Why? Jack wouldn't have <clears throat> any danger if you just had a kept Where's the wife, name. Milton? No. Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a <clears throat> showgirl? Or hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. <clears throat> Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. <clears throat> Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Oh, yeah. Give me a second. Return to work. What have I got to actually do? What have I got to do? Should 
Oh, il sent. This thing, don't worry. In my brain, it's built into it. <coughs> Bloody Luba. see my head be long, and see my beard be long as, and it's still the same. Well, that's her fool. No, hey, not. you know, I was wrong about you. Turned into a fine worker, Beard's Tim Milton. Oh, thank you. Means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. <clears throat> Oh. Nah. I want to shave, bro. Got too much hair. Too much. I need less hair. I want more hair. Oh. Hey, son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Is your father in? Can I have a word? Sure, I'll just get him. Pow! Hey, I'm right, right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? I'm sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well, besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could... Go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. But take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. I'm just joking, son. Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant cousin. Use my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. <laughs> You'll get her back. Yes, let's go, man. I get the range. That's that parcel. Oh, 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 oh,
Is this what she brought me? I want to know whether this is what she brought me. Oh no, man, can I just look at my clothes for a second? Brother, I can't make it not. Do you know how far that is? Courage saving armor. I don't want to go up to the I don't even want to go all the way down the back water from here. It's too long. Do I unlock this and I'm like, man, is this so um, good? I'm legit gonna go do that and check it. And yes, I'm walking over here. Look at this. Look at this. Alexa. Wait, so you buy it? Fifty two. Go. 
no shot. See, but that's what I'm talking about. Okay, that is not good. Nothing like it. I just need to know the shirt that he's wearing. It's the only thing I'm looking for because I know everything else. But make sure to go check out the project um, on the 25th slash 27th. Right now. Slash 24th or 25th. I'm only saying this because people in America are like a few hours behind to the point day is basically one day ahead so 24 to I'm gonna go check it out then and um and see you all there hope for you to watch it and hope that you join in give us your honest opinions on it uh what we should add what we should do that's better etc etc because we want your word and, and not uh, see us